Did the 39ers share guns? Yeah, we use the same guns. Okay. Did, have you ever seen Solomon Doyle with a gun? Yeah. Have you ever seen Leroy Price with a gun? Yeah. Have you ever seen Evans Lewis with a gun? Yeah. Have you ever seen Aston Price with a gun? Yes. Have you ever seen Woody with a gun? Yes. Have you ever seen Jasmine Perry with a gun? Yeah. Have you ever seen Curtis Neville with a gun? Judge leading. Objection sustained. Which of the guys at this table have you seen with a gun? I seen all of them with a gun. But Woody don't really carry no gun like that. Like, he ain't no real violent person. Like, you know, Woody ain't no real violent person. So he don't carry guns like how I say me and Red carry guns. Me and Pound carries guns before. AD, he, you know, he carry a gun if it come down to it or whatever like that. Like, he'll have a gun. I didn't really hang with AD all the way like that. Like, when I come uptown. When, you know, but Leroy, me and Leroy, we roll together with guns. Pony, Evans, Pound. I really can't see. Well, Trap, Saul, he ain't. He don't ride with guns like that, you know? He ain't really violent either like that. I want to ask you about crack. Did anybody off the Ninth Ward side sell crack? Before? Yeah, we sold crack before. Like, before we start hanging with, before we start hanging with them, like, you know, in 07. I used to sell crack, but the crack prices went up. Like, coke prices went up, and it don't make sense to sell crack. Heroin taking over, and you can make way more money in the heroin game than, you know, the coke game. I want to turn your attention to February 22nd, 2010. Did you have a friend named Percy? Yeah, he out to Florida. What happened to Percy? Percy, he got paralyzed, you know. He ain't like that either. He wasn't no violent person, and he got caught. He got caught in the wrong place at the wrong time. They shot him and paralyzed him. And when you say they, who shot Percy? The dudes out Press Park. Can you see this map? Yeah. And the G-strip was around the 1200, 1300 block of Florida, or I'm sorry, of Gallier, correct? Yeah. And the Florida, that was where the old Florida projects were, correct? Yeah. And then the desire was across the canal? Yeah, across the tracks. And then Press Park was that neighborhood over there? Yes. And did you all, you all had a problem with some people from Press Park? Press Park and the Desire, they ganged up together. They were like friends too, but they couldn't just go, they couldn't just beef with us by themselves. So what happened to, why did Percy get shot? I don't really know all the details why he got shot. I know that he got, well, where it was, he got shot because I object. He says he doesn't know the details himself. Sustained, objection sustained. Did you all have information on who shot him? Yes. And who shot him? Marty. And where's Marty from? He from Price Park. And what did you all, what did you decide to do in retaliation for Percy getting shot? Well, Percy is Woody's partner and Woody was acting like he was scared of them dudes. Like he wrecked the man's car like he was scared of them dudes. And I told him, I'm like, man, you gotta handle your business. If one of my close partners like that gets shot like that, I want to ride behind him. Like, it don't matter how it go. I'm going to ride behind them. I got to kill somebody behind them. So I'm telling Woody, like, man, we got to handle that. I want to help you. So what did you all do? One day we had two stolen cars. I had the F-150 and Woody and them was Woody and Real. They was in a Honda Jeep. And Real is Jasmine Perry? Yeah. Okay. Who was with you? Me and Pound. And what did you all do? We went and sat on the block in Bunker Hill. And what part of town is Bunker Hill in? The east. And how did you know to go to Bunker Hill? Because before that we had me, Breezy, Merle, Evans. We had went to the house before. And when we went and shot at the house door, but we went like half stepping. We didn't really know exactly like what house it was. But when we saw the people like standing in the front door, we start shooting, but they ran. All right. And was there a specific car you were looking for that night? Oh yeah, the green Monte Carlo. We had word that that's the car that, that they be in. And he, like, it came around one time on G-Strip and shot. And it was in the green Monte Carlo. So we know that the green Monte Carlo be by the house. So, and that night y'all are sitting in the Bunker Hill. Do y'all see the car? No. 
Okay, what happens next? We waited. We waited to see, really we waited for the car, or we waited to see any one of them dudes to kill them. So later on that night, the car pull up. When the car pull up, they went in the, the dude went in the house. So I called Woody and I'm like, listen, this is the plan. I say, I'm on one corner, like I'm standing. We on this corner right here. The house is the middle of the block and Woody and them on this, Woody and Rail on this corner. So we got the corner sewed up. He can't go nowhere. He got to come either my way to the stop sign or go their way to the stop sign. So I said, listen, when he get back in the car and when he pull off, if he come my way, I'm gonna stop at the stop sign and we're gonna jump out and we're gonna run up the car and shoot the car up. Y'all just get behind him and y'all jump out and shoot the car. I said, if they come y'all way, stop at the stop sign and jump out and shoot the car and we're gonna get behind them and we're gonna jump out and shoot the car. So that was the plan. So the, they come outside. Like, they come outside, I think, like, a few hours later or whatever like that with a girl. And Woody called me and was like, man, they got a girl in the car. I was like, man, that girl, man. Percy's son was in the car and they ain't care about, they ain't care about his son. So what we gonna worry about that girl for, man? Kill whoever in that car, man. So the phone hung up. When they pull off, that's when the shots came out. We went with our plan. They went Woody way and they stopped at the stop sign. And when I'm pulling up behind them, Woody and Rail jumped out and shot the car. And now the car backing up towards me by the, backing up towards me by, like, right by the fire hydrant. He can't go nowhere. So Pound get out the car. I had a chopper too, but I know one thing. Pound about to work him. Pound come out the car and hit the car with the chopper. And we seen there ain't no more movement going on. I backed up and pulled off. And we found out that dude was dead. What guns did Woody and Rail have? Woody had the chop. Objection, no foundation, sustained. Do you know what guns Woody and Rail had? Yeah. How do you know? Because before we, before we got there, we already had, we already set it up to know what guns, like, what person going to get. We already had the plan before we even much went. All right. What gun did you and Pound have? I had my, I had my AK in my name. My gun was in my name. But I kill you with it because I know one thing. If I shoot you with it, the police ain't going to know unless they get that gun. And so you and Pound were sharing a gun or... No, Pound had the gun, the same gun that I killed Gutter with. It's an AK-47. And what did Woody and Jasmine Perry have? Woody had the chopper and Jasmine Perry had a Glock 19. Is that... What caliber is that? A 9. Whose guns were all of these? You mentioned one of them was yours. One gun was in my name. The AK that Pound used, that's a gun that we just used. The chopper Woody had, we had so many choppers, so I don't really know. Ain't no gun just for a specific person, unless like, it's a personal gun. You're gonna know if that's your gun or not, because you're gonna keep it on you at all times. And same question about the Glock. Do you know whose gun that was? Just a random, a random gun. Would you recognize a photo of the car from that night if I showed to you? The Green Monte Carlo? Yes. Yeah. I move to publish what's already been admitted as Exhibit 130, photos 30, 35, and 38. All right. Does that look like the Monte Carlo y'all shot up that night? Yes. If you can go to 35, please. Same question. Does that look like the Monte Carlo? Yes. And 38, please. Thank you. Gregory, were you ever arrested by this crime or for this crime by NOPD? No, no, I never got arrested for no murder but Gregory Keys.